booster vaccine even as early as With January, the health minister giving details on Trinidad and Tobago's preparations to receive either the Moderna or Pfizer vaccines at today's press conference, with the hope that the country will be fully ready to receive either in March, there's another pressing concern that emerges for the ministry. When will the ministry really start their public education campaign? Because the anti vaxxer um, conversation has already begun in Trinidad and Tobago. We are totally against vaccines. The health minister had said before the ministry knew they had to try and get ahead of the propaganda. Today, he says, they've been at it for over a month now. We are starting the process of doing focus groups to find out what do Trinidadians think about vaccines? Where are they getting their information from? The focus group should have begun and he expects them to run into January. That information will be used to inform the ministry's approach. However, he says a strategic information plan has already been drafted and it has been sent to PAHO for their feedback. He also addressed ethnic distrust of vaccines from black and brown communities, drawing reference to the historic but medically unethical Tuskegee syphilis trials in the United States, but says that vaccines save lives. Currently, the U.S. is responding to those concerns by shining a light on the work of Dr. Kismakia Corbett. She has been described as being at the forefront of the development of the Moderna vaccine in the hope that they could get ahead of those fears because when they start their major vaccination program, they want as many people to willingly come for their shot, which is exactly what we also want right here. Sunny Gray, CNC3 News.